Hi, my name is Kim. I'm going to talk today about warm-up. One of my favorite classes in this gym is spinning and group ride. Your spin class will include a warm-up section, but I recommend getting on maybe five to seven minutes early and just pedal with a little bit of tension, get your muscles limbered up, and you're ready to go when your instructor sits down. My favorite part of the class is those 10 minutes before we start when we're all sitting warming up, pedaling, but chatting with all our friends and catching up on all our gossip. The best thing also about spin class is you bring your friends, it's a social atmosphere, you talk, you laugh, you high five, and we all work together as a group and everybody finishes first. Cooling down after a group ride class or a spin class, a dynamic stretch is a stretch that you normally do but through movement. So you can use dynamic stretches before and after your class. Stretching the hamstring, you bring a leg forward, you tip, feel that stretch, then you come back up, and then you continue doing it over and over. And that just recovers the body. Or a hip flexor stretch where you're dropping the knee up and down, maybe adding an arm to get a little more mobility and, and stretch. Now that I've shown you the cool down, that also works on a regular outdoor bike as well. It's an important part of recovery after any kind of a class or bike ride. So that's how you cool down and I hope that you'll uh, come and give us a try.